俺は軽い気持ちでデビルハンターなったけどよこの生活続けるためだったら死んでもいいぜ Welcome to Watch Mojo, and today we're counting down our picks for the top 30 anime of the 21st century, at least the ones released as of this video. Number 30 My Hero Academia. It's the juggernaut that continues to deconstruct while paying homage to the cliches that make superheroes so beloved. <laughs> Set in a world where the majority of the population are imbued with otherworldly abilities, it falls to the once quickless Midoriya to rise up to the challenge as the world's next greatest hero. Between the hijinks of Class 1A, commentary on hero society as a whole, the clashes with the League of Villains, as well as the beautifully woven character development, there's a reason why each new season of this show continues to be a seasonal event. Plus Ultra. United Number 29, Higurashi, When They Cry. One of the most talked about horror anime of the last few decades, the Higurashi franchise follows Keiichi, a young boy who moves to a small village shortly before a festival. <laughs> However, deaths are common around the time of this festival, and death strikes again this time, and the time after that, over and over again. Higurashi's takes on time loops and horror helps it stand out among other horror anime. It may take several loops and multiple anime series to unravel the mystery, but any fans of cute characters doing cute things and unspeakable violence are sure to enjoy the ride. <laughs> Number 28, Mob Psycho 100. With its unpolished art style and goofy character designs, it can be easy to dismiss Mob Psycho, but if you do, you're making a mistake. <laughs> This series follows Mob, a teenage boy who has difficulty with both his emotions and his psychic powers. Although the show often features him going up against spirits and other espers in mind blowing fight scenes, it's just as much about Mob growing up and finding his place in the world. <laughs> Additionally, the series features an extensive supporting cast, all of whom are fleshed out and hilarious in their own rights. We're looking at you, Reagan. Full of not only humor and action, but also plenty of heart, Mob Psycho 100 is an anime that's 100% amazing. <laughs> Number 27 Made in Abyss. Don't let its adorable character designs fool ya. Made in Abyss goes as dark and deep as its titular chasm. The series follows a pair of kids aiming to explore an abyss. From that simple premise, Made in Abyss takes its protagonists to some grim places, even if the animation is utterly gorgeous. <laughs> the plot moves in unexpected ways, and the world building is fantastic. This show will tug at your heartstrings and maybe pull them out. But if you're willing to peer into it, Made in Abyss will give you plenty back, for better or for worse.
Number 26. Naruto Series One of the biggest shonen franchises of the 21st century, Naruto and its sequel series primarily follow the titular young ninja. The story of Naruto's journey to become Hokage, his village's leader, has captured the attention of generations of anime fans at this point. The world and characters are expansive and fire the imagination. The fights are epic and unforgettable, and the music is spectacular too. The franchise also deals with surprisingly serious subject matter as well, with heartbreaking backstories and themes like generational hatred. While the story of Naruto himself is largely over, the franchise endures and keeps growing and obtaining new fans. Number 25. The Melancholy of Haruhi Suzumiya did the Endless Eight nearly drive us to the brink? Yes. Do we regret a second of watching the SOS Brigade engage in all manner of misadventures with the threat of reality shattering at every turn? Not a chance. There's something so charming about watching a cynical bastard like Kion get dragged around by the eternally optimistic force of nature that is Haruhi Suzumiya, who just happens to unknowingly hold the ability to twist time and space on a whim. Throw in time travelers, data mines, and other anomalies, and you have a recipe for a damn good time. Just not if you're Kion. <laughs> Number 24, Hajime no Ippo. A true gem of the sports genre that quite frankly deserves way more attention than it's gotten, considering it delivered a true underdog story interwoven with incredible fights, a whole host of endearing fighters, and such an overwhelming love for boxing, it's almost palpable. Witnessing the meek and kind-hearted Ippo go from victim to champion makes for quite the hero's journey, one helmed by the question of what does it truly mean to be strong? Now! <laughs> Whether you're here to see Ippo flatten his opponents or the endless training montages, this series is a feast that quite frankly should have gotten a fourth season by now. Number 23. Madoka Magica There have been many who have tried to twist and subvert the magical girl genre, and while there have been a few valiant attempts, none have come close to measuring up to the hauntingly beautiful tale conjured up by the master of broken feels, Gen Urobuchi. <laughs> While an encounter with an adorable wishmaker sounds like the chance the shy Madoka and her friends have been looking for, they soon learn that there are consequences for living out a fantasy, and that even the purest of intentions can be corrupted. It's a true game changer, one that isn't afraid to shatter any and all preconceptions, no matter how much misery it brings our colorful heroines. <laughs> Number 22, Show Again Roku Rakugo Shinju. Shisho! Oira, Anta ni stera retar do ni mo nara nen da yo! Na mo naku nat chimaun da! Eh, so okay. Something of a cultural phenomenon that managed to shake up the anime scene with its potent drama, bittersweet characterization, and skillful narrative accessibility to the ancient arts of Rakugo storytelling. We can't do enough justice as to just how unique, fulfilling, and wonderfully recognized this series is. <laughs> So, 
After a former Yakuza serves his time, he sets out into the world in order to become a Rakugo performer, now under the strained tutelage of a rather unwilling master practitioner. Fueled by the conflict both on and off stage, this one truly is something special. <laughs> Number 21. Oshinoko Idols are a popular subject for anime, but Oshinoko, like the real idol industry, hides darkness beneath its glamorous appearance. Featuring a complex plot involving reincarnation and murder, Oshinoko is an intriguing mystery, though it blends several other genres together as well. The cast is engaging, flawed, and they all grow over time, thanks to frequent time skips. The story is gripping throughout, and each new cliffhanger leaves us wanting more, with its distinctive animation, high stakes, and discussion of many taboo topics. Oshinoko is an anime we can't help but idolize. Number 20, Monogatari series. How does one even quantify this show? だったろう。いや、間違っていたのかもしれない。なぜなら、彼女の体がとても、とてつもなく、軽かったからだ。a half-vampire going around saving the ladies in his life from supernatural oddities, accompanied by a stunning animation landscape, fourth wall breaks, striking visual metaphors, and enough sexual awkwardness to make anyone's high school experience seem tame by comparison. <laughs> There's something here for everyone, since Araragi seems to get into as many blistering battles as he does encounter top tier ladies. This show is truly one of a kind, and we wouldn't have it any other way. <laughs> Number 19, Kaiji. Turns out death can be scarier than the most horrific creatures to crawl out of the anime cesspool. <laughs> Gliding through life as a hopeless loser, our man Kaiji finds himself in the unfortunate position of accruing an astronomical amount of debt, and in order to escape financial hell, he's going to have to risk his life. <laughs> With numerous and dangerous gambling gauntlets to overcome, watching Kaiji use his wits to claw his way out of the direst straits isn't only exhilarating, but also makes us feel much, much better about our own life choices. Stay away from pachinko machines, everyone. We're a Number 18, One Punch Man. Say what you will about the rather lackluster reception of season two, the strongest hero's original outing was pretty much hype incarnate. <laughs> Focusing on the antics of a caped crusader with the strength to decimate any villain with but a single swipe of his fist, this series managed to balance crazy action sequences, absurd hilarity, as well as the tricky tightrope that is maintaining tension, in spite of the fact we all know there's nothing in the cosmos that can stop Saitama and his doomsday knuckle sandwich. <laughs> Take every anime convention you think you know and prepare for it to get smashed to pieces with just one punch. Number 17, Fate Zero. 
the Uro Butcher strikes again, only this time he's taken the already savage nature of the Fate Viz and somehow managed to push it to the very apex of dark and depressing. Taking place during the Fourth Holy Grail War, this prequel once again illustrates the many fantastical battles between various human masters and their servants summoned from ages past. While the fight scenes are a true spectacle thanks to UFO Table's god tier animation, Zero's relentless exploration into the worst that mankind has to offer will undoubtedly stain your soul by the end. Why must you make us suffer with your genius, Urobuchi? <laughs> Number 16, Bleach. One of Shonen's original big three, Bleach follows Ichigo Kurosaki, a teenager who becomes involved in battles between various spiritual factions. <laughs> These include the monstrous hollows, the samurai-like Shinigami, and the bow-wielding Quincy's. Swords, transformations, and fights galore abound in this action-packed series. The original anime may have ended before the full story could be adapted, but Thousand Year Blood War came back with top tier animation and pacing tighter than the show's smooth soundtrack. While it doesn't delve as deep as some other shonens, Bleach has an undeniable cool factor. <laughs> Number 15, Demon Slayer Kimetsu no Yaiba. If we want to talk about pure monetary success, Demon Slayer might be the most successful on our list. One of its films became the highest grossing Japanese film ever made, and its manga has sold gangbusters too. And it owes that success to its engrossing story. <laughs> Tanjiro's quest to restore his sister Nezuko's humanity after she's turned into a demon tugs at the heartstrings. Demon Slayer is as emotional as its fights are epic, and, well, just look at that animation. This series has us all out of breath as its characters. Number 14, Monster. You don't know evil until you've met Johann Liebert. I was supposed to die that night. You're the one who resurrected me, Doctor. After a surgeon chooses to save the life of a young boy over that of a political figure, not only does he find his career in jeopardy, but he may have unwittingly unleashed a genius psychopath on the world, one not even the remnants of the Nazi party can control, who can also easily convince you to slaughter your loved ones with just a casual conversation. Well, Richard, how about a drink? Yep, that's Johan for you. Along with Dr. Tenma, this series thrust us into a deadly game between these two polar opposites, as Johan's continuous atrocities further push what is ultimately a decent man to consider crossing the unforgivable line of murder. It'll all end here, on this spot. Number 13, Kaguya-sama, Love is War. All's fair in love and war, right? And it's fair to say that this rom-com blows many others in its genre away. The series follows the titular heiress and her mutual love with top student Miyuki. However, their mutual bride has them both trying to maneuver the other into confessing first. This lends the series a strange, strategic element that's unlike anything else in the genre. <laughs> the central romance is wildly entertaining enough, but their friends become involved too, leading to even more romantic and hysterical entertainment. Kaguya-sama is a rom-com we'd gladly go to war for any day. <laughs> 
ずっと続けばいいのに No.12 Steins Gate As far as sci-fi epics go, few have ever come close to matching this show's caliber, wit, and world-building. <laughs> Upon the realization that he can send texts back into the past via a microwave, Okabe and his gaggle of colleagues, misfits, and legendary best girl Kurisu think they've cracked the greatest scientific discovery of all time. And they have. And now they're gonna pay for it. <laughs> Whether it's mysterious corporations gunning for their lives, or trying to find a way to beat death through time jumps, the way the narrative spirals, contorts, and ultimately resolves easily earned it the mantle of one of modern anime's greatest. Number 11, Jojo's Bizarre Adventure. From Phantom Blood to Stone Ocean, from Jonathan's Diamond Chin all the way to Jolene's Killer Strings, Jojo Mania has managed to infiltrate every corner of the anime scene in the mere blink of an eye. We couldn't be happier. With each series chronicling the tragedies and triumphs of the Joestar bloodline, every iteration has brought its own unique flair, setting, and fabulous dress sense. Whether you're all about Joseph and his outlandish sense of comic timing, Jotaro and his penchant for punches, or Josuke and his divine hairdo, there's truly a JoJo experience out there for everyone. Number 10, Jujutsu Kaisen. This series name means sorcery battle, and there's plenty of both to go around. Jujutsu Kaisen features sorcerer students and teachers facing curses and other villainous foes. Its dark, almost horror-inspired tone gives a darker edge than most other shonen series. With its blistering pace and incredible action, Jujutsu Kaisen has kept viewers on the edge of their seats since it began, with each new hype fight or heartbreaking death being hot topics around the internet water cooler. <laughs> Jujutsu Kaisen, like the domains its sorcerers use, is expanding all the time, or at least its fan base is. <laughs> Number 9, Gintama. You have shows that go out of their way to blend comedy and action, and then you have Gintama, which somehow managed to excel and layer the two together so seamlessly it became a beast all of its own. Parodying everything under the sun, outrageous slapstick, never shying away from taking a stab at other anime, all the while giving us a gaggle of crazy samurai, aliens, and other misfits who never fail to get themselves into trouble. And yet, it still succeeds in pulling off conflicts, emotional twists, and intriguing narratives that put most other series out to pasture. Gintoki is just that good. <laughs> Number 8, Free Ren, Beyond Journey's End. There are a lot of fantasy series out there, but Free Ren is something special. The eponymous elf was once part of a group that defeated the Demon King. Now, as her companions have aged or died, she finds herself looking back with fondness on their journey as she sets out on a new one. Why 
Like its title implies, Beyond Journey's End focuses on more than the destination, with Freeran and her companions' everyday lives taking center stage. While there are plenty of action moments, the show's bigger focus is on the subtle relationships between characters and their emotions, with regrets being emphasized especially. Free Ren is a beautiful series that has plenty to say about life and a surprising number of gags about mimics. Number 7. Death Notes Death Note. The shining star of anime's occult thriller scene, the battle of wits between the wannabe god of the new world and the eccentric detective was a masterclass in storytelling, giving us a psychological game of chess where every move potentially equaled death. After gaining the titular death note and discovering he can kill whoever he wishes by just writing down their name, a student like Yagami decides to purge the rotten world of those he views as evil, only to have his future utopia threatened by the mysterious L. <laughs> The mental warfare, the ingenious twists, the shades of grey surrounding each character, this property truly raised the bar for the medium. Cut. Cut. Number 6. Vinland Saga This incredible Viking anime follows the life of Torfinn, a boy from Greenland who seeks revenge on a mercenary band. Sausenda. The series features stellar animation, incredible action, and a story that will grab you by the throats and never let go. The show is unflinching in its brutality, depicting the best and worst of human nature and portraying war and vengeance as futile and self-destructive. <laughs> Torfin's rage and gradual redemption make for one of the most compelling character arcs in all of anime. Vinland Saga is as epic a tale as you can find in any medium, and a modern masterpiece. Number 5. Code Geass how far would you go in order to free an oppressed people from a tyrannical rule, even if said tyrants were your own family? Well, if you're Lelouch v Britannia, you inherit a mind-controlling pair of peepers, start a revolution, and give us one of the best sci-fi series of the modern age. While Lelouch's crusade to free the Japanese masses from the elitist empire he once called home is enthralling, its moral ambiguity in how the war for freedom creates more monsters than heroes is what truly pushes the series above its peers. Number 4. Hunter Hunter it might come across as your average light-hearted shonen at first glance, but as any fan knows, Gon's goal to become a hunter and find his father is utterly exceptional in just about everything it does. Oh, the character progression of its leads, the intricacies of its power system, the way it approaches each story arc and flips every convention on its head, the scale of its fights, how each villain is the furthest thing from generic, and perhaps most importantly, how it managed to elevate Gon punching a humanoid cat's face to the anime equivalent of a renaissance painting. Honestly, our biggest complaint is we may never see a sequel series even if we wait to the next century. Number 3. Attack on Titan 
What started off as a brutal and uncompromising dark fantasy has since propelled itself to legendary status, all thanks to its medley of visceral action, fascinating premise, and gradual narrative maturity. With humanity close to extinction due to the endless hunger of giant cannibalistic creatures known as titans, it falls to a small core to slay the beasts and slowly reclaim mankind's grip on the world, at least until they discover that there's just as much danger behind the walls. <laughs> After all, humans that are willing to take their sacrilegious secrets to the grave are deadlier than any titan. Look, once you see Levi strut his stuff, you're gonna be hooked either way. Number 2. Guren Lagan. You don't know the meaning of bombastic until you've witnessed the unfiltered tour de force that is this series, one that not only gave us some of the most badass scenes ever, but also introduced us to the man, the myth, the shirtless legend himself, Kamina. <laughs> As the fleeting human resistance struggles against the armadas of the Beastmen race, hope arrives in the form of the timid digger, Simon, who along with some of the most ludicrously awesome mecha you've ever seen, slowly start to tin the tide for humanity's survival. Just who the hell do you think they are? <laughs> Before we unveil our number one pick, here's some honorable mentions. Golden Kamui. There's treasure in Hokkaido, and every weirdo is after it. <laughs> Haikyuu. Volleyball has rarely been so hype. Yuru Camp. Great outdoors can be cozy too. <sighs> Spy Family. Comedy, espionage, and wholesomeness all blend together perfectly. <laughs> Before we continue, be sure to subscribe to our channel and ring the bell to get notified about our latest videos. You have the option to be notified for occasional videos or all of them. If you're on your phone, make sure to go into your settings and switch on notifications. Number 1. Full Metal Alchemist Brotherhood from its characters to its philosophy, all the way to its blinding fight scenes, the Elric brothers' quest to reclaim their bodies is downright mesmerizing. <laughs> it's honestly a struggle to pick out one thing this series fails at, as it not only faithfully adapts Hiromu Arakawa's work to a T, but utterly excels in balancing its intricate fantasy battles with some seriously heavy subjects. Religion, militarism, genocide, family, sacrifice, and revenge all permeate the series from the get-go, so rest assured, while it knows when to bring the smiles thanks to its iconic and flawed cast of alchemists, it also isn't afraid to delve into the darkest aspects of the human experience. Is there a quality anime of the 21st century we missed? Explain how we can improve in the comments below. <laughs> Did you enjoy this video? Check out these other clips from Watch Mojo, and be sure to subscribe and ring the bell to be notified about our latest videos.